22 years ago today, this guy got me through one of the worst days in American history. Now he serves our country to help keep evil at bay. We will never forget the 2,977 Americans lost on 9-11. In the first full year after 9-11 attacks, 181,510 Americans joined active duty. 72,908 enlisted in the reserves. Make no mistake about it, my resolve is steady and strong about winning this war that has been declared on America. George W. Bush, September 13, 2001. I could hear you, the rest of the world hears you, and the people who knock these buildings down will hear all of us soon. George W. Bush, September 14, 2001 The attack took place on American soil, but it was an attack on the heart and soul of this civilized world, and the world has come together to fight a new and different war the first, and we hope, the only one of the 21st century. A war against all those who seek to export terror, and a war against those governments that support and shelter them. President George W. Bush, October 11, 2001. Our war on terror begins with Al-Qaeda, but does not end there. It will not end until every terrorist group of global reach has been found, stopped, and defeated. George W. Bush, September 20, 2001 On this somber day, and in remembrance of those lost on 9-11, I am incredibly proud of our son and all of those who serve to keep the evil at bay.